I'm George Baird, uh, uh, Emeritus Professor of Architecture and former Dean of the Daniels Faculty. The last thing I read was a book called Big Men Fear Me, and it's a biography of a man called George McCullough, who in the 1930s bought two Toronto newspapers, one called The Globe and one called The Mail, and combined them into the newspaper we now know as the Globe and Mail. He was a brilliant but troubled man who um, had, a, you know, considerable success, except uh, was brought down by mental illness and uh, committed suicide. Fascinating history, and it showed me a history of Toronto in the 30s and 40s when my fa first my father and then myself was growing up. I read the Globe and Mail daily. I read the New Yorker magazine weekly, and I read the New York Review of Books um, monthly or so. Um, I also read books, although since I've been in ill health, I've read fewer books. I prefer to read lying on the sofa. I don't take notes and I don't summarize readings. I make connections among different readings by following up on bibliographical references in books that I find interesting. I do discuss what I've read some of the time. I've certainly uh, discussed the McCullough book with a number of other people who read it, and we've all found it fascinating. The book that changed my life is a book called The Human Condition by the philosopher Hannah Arendt, uh, which I read back in the 60s, and it uh, completely demolished the philosophical basis for functionalism via Arendt's critique of utilitarian philosophy. Thank you.